by Deep Silver. That's surprising. Cry Engine. Or, you know, no, for the Crisis series. Charles IV, King of Bohemia and Holy Roman Emperor, had a long and successful reign. The empire he ruled from Prague expanded, and his subjects lived in peace and prosperity. When the emperor died, the whole empire mourned. More than 7,000 people accompanied him on his last procession. The heir to the throne of the flourishing empire was Charles's son, Wenceslas IV, whose father had prepared him for this moment all his life. But Wenceslas did not take after his father. He neglected affairs of state for more frivolous pursuits. I think it's pretty obvious. He even failed to turn up for his own coronation as emperor. <laughs> which did little to endear him to the Pope. <laughs> Wenceslas the Idol did not impress the imperial nobility either. His difficulties mounted until the nobles, exasperated by the inaction of their ruler, turned for help to his half-brother, King Sigismund of Hungary. Sigismund decided on a radical solution. He kidnapped the king to force him to abdicate, then took advantage of the ensuing disorder to gain greater power for himself. Mm. He invaded Bohemia <clears throat> with a massive army and began pillaging the territories of the king's allies. It is here that my story begins. I bet. Seems like the half-brother was shady and did some pretty shifty stuff. Huh. Graphics remind me of a little bit of oblivion. Anyway, let's see if I can try to talk with the British accent. I'm not really good at accents as my friend or my fiance. But, welcome to the Kingdom Come Deliverance. No, I can't do it. I tried. <clears throat> so, anyway, welcome to the Kingdom Come Deliverance walkthrough. I played a good chunk of it and I very much thoroughly enjoyed it. So, it's great to get back with the video game marathon to play this game again. Because I was excited to do it again. I, 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 I couldn't lie. This is one of the games in the K section I was excited to play again. So, let's get back to it again. Now, no subtitles, as you guys already know. Uh, no. I definitely want tutorials. This game is actually tough. It's actually really realistic in its comeback and all that, but it's so detailed. Just the amount of detail that went into this game is crazy. It's really crazy. I know I'm going to lose an hour of this. There's just no way I'm not. I'm going to just lose an hour. And I would not be surprised. This game is so detailed, but there's so much going on. Anyway, you'll see. Yes, definitely. For this game, will I also get the DLC? Ante Nostra, qui es in seris, sanctificeto nomen tuum, veniat regnum tuum, fiat voluntas tua, sicut in celo et in... It feels like he's there, he's speaking in your ear, that's kind of creepy, right? It's like a little bit of Hellblade, that's also creepy. Trust me, I will put this, um... My... Oh yeah, the music was well done too, I really got Alright, let's see how long it has it been. Freaking 2018 and 20. It's been a while. Yeah, we just want to get as far as I got last time. Hmm. 
Yeah, that's fine. Oh, definitely not hardcore mode. No, no, definitely normal mode. Yeah, he did. Graphics are not that bad. It's actually pretty good. Plus the music really fits in this world. This is such a realistic... Alright. Is it really based on a real life place? Oh. Yeah, I think it got inspiration from a real life place. Maybe that's why it's just so detailed. God bless. Same to you. Today's a scorch. Gosh, they just set you guys all up to... The, this town is gonna burn, isn't it? Well, I played this game, so I know what happens in the town. But they just set them up to die. It's just way too happy. Well, husband, how goes it? Good. I should get it finished today. Where on earth is Henry? I need him to run some errands. He was still sleeping when I went out. At this hour... Blue-blooded idler. Well, it looks like he was out all evening, drinking like a lord. <laughs> Go and get the lazy bones up then. Quick clout round the ear should do it. Mm -hmm. Oh, you know the mom and dad get a lot of action. No! Ah! I feel like I'm watching some kind of like a film. Henry! Get up now. There's work to be done. That's your mom? She looks way too young to be your mom. Get up or I'll come get you up, you slugger bed. Hear that? You'd better not vex him. Now get up quick. Your breakfast is on the table. Wait, what's this? Have you been... Oh, Henry. How many times have I told you about fighting? Oh, it's nothing. It's just a scratch. You've been at that sword play again, haven't you? You'd better pray your father doesn't get to hear of it. You know how he feels about it. Oh, don't worry, it wasn't that. I, I just scratched myself is all. Hmm. Well, just don't come crying to me if you really do get hurt. Now get up, you rogue. I'm a punkish rogue. I'm hooked. Yeah. Story is well done and detailed. Oh. Sure. Take it a little bit. Did the game freeze? Oh, no, no. It's just loading. Okay. It's like a bit of Elder Scrolls but realistic better character models than Elder Scrolls I sorry Elder Scrolls I I, I love that I like the Elder Scrolls series but 
let's face it, they're so buggy per the course of Bethesda. Well, except for uh, Doom and Wolf. Fine stuff. state you're in this morning. What on earth did you get up to last night? Oh, okay. Oh, and it shows up. Okay. If it was my mom, what would I say? I was with Bianca. We were, um, talking? Talking, were you? That's what you call it, is it? Uh... Stop it, Ma. Well, I've got a feeling there's something you're not telling me. And it's connected with that scratch on your hand. And that suspicious looking character with a sword who turned up in town recently. I'm gonna naturally lie to my mom, of course. I was with Bianca. Do you want a blow by blow account of everything we did? What's this, an interrogation? It is. All right, all right. Sorry, son. It's just that I worry about you. Thanks, Ma, but I'm not four years old. I know, Hal. You've grown up in front of my eyes. It's hard to get used to it. Did Matthew and Fritz come looking for me? No, I haven't seen them this morning. They shouldn't be hard to find. They'll be hanging around a tavern somewhere, as usual. Matthew and Fritz aren't drunkards. I never said they were, did I? And if I really minded you going for a beer with them, I'd have put a stop to it long ago. I was young once, too, you know. And your father was no angel when he was in Kuttenberg. Oh, uh, do I want to ask? I am curious. Of course he wasn't. <laughs> you don't believe me? Ask him yourself. All right, I will. You're not a boy anymore, Henry. You're a man, and it's time to start acting like one. Yesterday, you promised your father you'd help at the forge. If you made yourself useful now and then, I wouldn't mind your mischief making so much. Can I get something to eat? I left some breakfast on the table. Help yourself. Yay! His mom loves him to prepare breakfast. Even though he's a lazy bum who doesn't do anything. His father angry with me for sleeping late. He's not happy. Yesterday you promised him you'd help finish that sword for Saratzik. He's not as young as he was. And you know how his joints pain him. He's too proud to complain. But he needs your help, Henry. I know. Don't worry, Ma. Of course I'll help him. Good. He always says his knees ache when there's a storm coming. I hope they're wrong this time. It's looking like such a nice day. Oh, she said, you guys are gonna all die. Do you need me to do anything, Ma? Ah, you're a good lad. But I'm fine. It's your father needs helping with that sword. It really does look like oblivion, but more detail. Bethesda, you can learn a thing or two. Maybe when you go to the PS5, your games won't be as buggy. Sorry, Elder Scrolls and Bethesda. You do have better polished games, Wolfenstein and Doom. But anything like, you know, the game Elder Scrolls? Gosh, this reminds me of Elder Scrolls in the best way possible. I'm just gonna take all that. Mom, where's breath? Oh, there it is. What? No wine? Is this a wine and cheese party? No? Well, I'm gonna eat. Take this cheese. And I'm gonna eat. Ow. Right. Uh. Okay. 
Just gonna take all of those apples. Because, you know, real pricks eat apple is the saying. I would say this is a nice house, but this is kind of the 1400s, so <laughs> the standards of housing is kind of remotely different from 2021. Ooh. Ah, I'm a grown, I'm a growing man. I have to eat because my mom prepared it for me. Oh, I don't have a luck pick. I might as well save. What? Oh. Trader or tavern? Okay. Right, I forgot this game's realistic, so it takes lots of materials to save and do anything. Nope. Well, yeah, I mean, the game even tells you right off the bat if you drink too much, you're screwed. Is that chili? Mom! Do we have a day more to eat? What is it, my boy? Man, they're really setting you up to die. Good luck, Dan. Just like Oblivion. Oh. Stealth. Man, they're really just trying to go all realistic. Hi, Dodd. I'm sorry I slipped a wee late. Don't be angry with me. What's the matter with you, Henry? Didn't you hear me calling you? Oh! Actually, statistics on... Persuade my dad. Oh boy. Sorry, Father. I was taking a stroll and lost track of time. Somehow I had a feeling I was seeing everything for the first time. How, my boy? When are you going to get some sense? Anyway, we've a lot of work to do today. I'm finishing the sword for Sir Radzik, and I need your help. With what? I'm running out of charcoal. Run to the market and buy a bag from the charcoal burner. I'll need some money then. Yeah, that's the other thing. Kunesh still owes me for an axe, a hammer, and the nails I sold him a month ago. Not to mention his debt from before. Go and tell him to pay up, at least for the axe and hammer, and then use the money to buy the charcoal. Kunesh? Not drunkard? <laughs> that'll be fun. Well, you're a big lad now. I'm sure you can manage. If not, tell him that next time I'll come myself and personally use that hammer to bang those nails into his arse. Sure he'll be happy to hear it. Is that all? Not quite. The Chamberlain at the castle has the cross guard for Sir Radzik's sword, which I had engraved in Sassau. You want me to go and pick it up? All right. Money, charcoal, cross guard. Got it. And ale. <laughs> Stop off at the tavern on your way home. I know you'll be going there anyway to see that girl of yours. But make sure the ale's still cool from the cellar when you get back. Her name is Bianca. Right, so make sure Bianca draws me a nice cool one. Run along now, work won't wait. Well, that's rude. Come on. She has a name. 
Her name is Bianca. Not like a horse. But her. Uh, oh, well, I guess that's offensive. About time. Have you got everything I wanted? Not yet. I'm working on it. And how much longer will it take? Get a move on. We have to finish that sword today. Um, or do you want me to look a fool in front of Sir Radzik? Yeah, no, like... I don't. I'll be back soon. Yeah, like a dancing clown. What did you actually do in Kuttenberg? Oh, all sorts. You had to be able to put your hand to anything if you wanted to make a living. But I was never far from iron. I'd like to see Kuttenberg sometime. I'll take you there one day, never fear. It's a beautiful city. But in the end, you'll learn the best places here by the Sasso. We've kind nobles, fertile land, and plenty of everything. And do you know Sir Radzig well? We've known each other long enough. Seems like you have a history. Kamaro, Kamaro to you, villager. Kind of clean all that hate. Gosh, just the lack of technology you guys have and convenience. Okay, now to find this drunkard so we can actually get paid. How do I run again? Oh, it's O. You seem like a friendly chap. Goodish, huh? Pay me my money, you drunken hazard pay. God be with you, Kunesh. What do you want? My father sent me to get the coin you owe him for the axe, hammer, and nails. I've got nothing. Clear off. Are you for real? Oh, no. No, he's a prick. I'm, I'm gonna beat his face. I knew you'd be trouble. Father says if you don't pay up, he'll come here himself and hammer those nails into your hairy ass. <laughs> I'd like to see him try. Fuck off, you bastard, or your old man will be pulling those nails out of you. Yeah, now what? No. I must have misheard you. It sounded like you just told me to clear off. But you wouldn't be stupid enough to think you can steal not pay your debts and then try to scare me, would you? You son of a whore! How dare you speak to me like that? Didn't your thieving father teach you any manners? No? Well, I'll teach you then. Goodbye. I would like to see you try, you old drunken douchebag. Oh! Have <laughs> Kurva. Come on. Come on, come on. Ow. Ow. Really? Go. Take. What's up? Come on, you're you know. oh. Get beat by this old drunken douche. Uh, 
I won't. Come here, Lily Liver. You're going to cry now. Oh, no, are you? You had it coming, you pup. And your old man can fuck off too. Can I hit him? I'm gonna punch him. Ah! Shut up. Rick! Oh! Okay. Man, he pissed me off to a T. Wow, that really was a realistic fight. I was sluggish. I didn't have all of Thought I could actually beat that old drugger, but... Drunker, but nope. I was actually struggling. I'm gonna beat this guy. I am determined to beat him. I don't know why. Pay my dad, you prick. God be with you, Kunai. What do you want? My father said... I've got nothing. I knew you'd be trouble. I'd like to see him try. I must have misheard you. You son of a whore. How dare you... Goodbye. Okay, so... Lock on is the... Uh, R3. Okay, good to know. Bring it on. Come on. Oh, bring it. I'm going to enjoy this. Come on! Take your beating, old man! What's the matter? Come on! You seem like you're getting... Okay, seriously, that's pissing me off. Stop moving, you prick.
Take that. Enough! Enough! I give up. Take what you want. It's not much, but it's all I have. You understand? That's what you get. That's what you get, you old prick. How'd you like your beating? Yeah, say there. Yeah, sit there. You just got beat by a young man. How you doing? How you doing? All right, blacksmith's boy. You got the better of me. Take what you want, but you haven't heard the last of this. I'm glad, Kadesh. So we can fight another round and I can show you how I beat you, old man. I don't know why that was satisfying that it should have been. That was fun. That was fun for some reason. Alright, I'm curious. So what happens if I basically find another path? I'm curious. Yeah? Yeah, let's do it. Alright, now I'm curious if we find another path, if that actually... What if we talk him down, or like, hey... There's so much dialogue choices, but I'm very curious of where this will go. Hmm. Okay, now let's try the Diplomatic, because it was satisfying to just beat the crowd very realistic and hard. But I enjoyed it. God be with you, Kunesh. What do you want? My father sent me to get the coin you owe him for the axe, hammer, and nails. I've got nothing. Clear off. No. I knew you'd be trouble. Father says if you don't pay up, he'll come here himself and hammer those nails into your hairy ass. I'd like to see him try. Fuck off, you bastard, or your old man will be pulling those nails out of you. Look, I know things aren't easy. Your wife ran off, booze is dear these days, and you're as much use as a square wheel. It's no wonder you're short of coin. But a debt's a debt, and I can't leave here without something. You son of a whore. How dare you speak to me like that? Didn't your thieving father teach you any manners? No? Well, I'll teach you then. Sure. Oh, okay, so... Either way, I had to have a reputation and that will work. Okay, so what if I try another path? That's what I like about this game. It's so intricate in its choices. So yeah, uh, my Henry's path will probably be extremely different from another person's Henry's path. Yeah, it's just classic, I guess, Elder Scrolls, but it's an RPG, but so realistic. People might be intimidated that it's so realistic, but no, I I, I welcome the challenge. Even if it's going to be unique and it's going to be something different, I freaking welcome the challenge. God be with you, Kunesh. What do you want? My father sent me to get the coin you owe him for the- I've got nothing. Clear up. Okay, so what if I... do this? I knew you'd be trouble. I'd like to see it. If that's the way you want it. I'll tell father you won't pay and you can tell him what you told me. And don't come back. That is true. I guess I'll wash myself.
All right, so there's another way we can get to it. Maybe I can throw an archer? I'm just gonna go in there. Hmm, a locked chest. I'll need a lockpick to get into that. Fritz might have one. Let you have his pot because he's been a dick. Okay, so most likely. Don't think he can copy. So, you're right, you prick. Okay. But all there's this. I already got it, and man, for the first maybe twenty or thirty bits, a bit already impressed. Why have I been impressed? Because, gosh, I. Yeah, there's a lot of things to like about it. Story pacing and story is actually well done. The history, just, it feels lived in and well realized. The gameplay is tight because of how realistic it is. The voice acting is actually top notch for this type of game. Which it shouldn't be, but it is. And it's actually detailed. It's like realistic graphics, but done well. So, hey, complete. God be with you, Kunesh. What? My father sent me to... I've got nothing. You know you owe father for a lot more than just the axe and hammer. If he went to the bailiff about it, you'd be in deep water. At least pay for the tools if you can't pay for everything. I told you I have no coin, you bastard. Get the hell out of here, or I'll use the axe on you. All right. I must have misheard you. It sounded like you just told me to clear off. But you wouldn't be stupid enough to think you can steal, not pay your debts, and then try to scare me. Would you? You son of a whore. How dare you speak to me like that? Didn't your thieving father teach you any manners? No? Well, I'll teach you then. Bye. I don't mind combat with them. So you guys already saw me win. It was a long and kind of pathetic fight, but I did earn that tools back because he was such a dick. Okay, so now I can get the charcoal since I got the tools from the drunken, well, the drunken douchebag. So, hey, all in a day's work. So, how does it feel like sitting in your own blood? Not so good, doesn't it? So we know who's the alpha male in this. Okay, so now... Henry, I'm glad you came. Hi. Good health to you. We do need charcoal. 
Wait, how much charcoal do we need for dad? He... Did he tell me? Crap, I forgot. I don't... Good luck, then. Guess, uh... Oh, wow. Henry actually has a lot of blood from that drunken guy? Ah, that's kind of pathetic. Wait, how much charcoal do we need? You can't be serious, Dutch. Insulting our king. What insult? I say only the truth. Sigismund has done only what he had to. I had to. He had to abduct the king. He had to lure his cousin Prokop into a trap and imprison him. He had to invade with his army of Tatars and besiege Kutenberg. Why not? What is this Wenceslas for a king? The empire is falling asunder in his hands. The German counts elected Ruprecht of the Palatinate as king because your Wenceslas would not go to their deeds even. German counts. Traitors. Now, even the Pope God be with you, Ellie. I'm with you, Matthew. What's going on here? Deutsche spouting shit. What? Just listen and you'll hear for yourself. Someone has to bring order and reunite the Empire! <laughs> what do I care about the Austrians? And nowadays, not even the devil himself can keep up with all the Popes. Which is the rightful Pope? The one in Rome or the one in Avignon? Do not blaspheme, Alex. No, it's true, though. Wenceslas is the king of Bohemia. Bohemian nobles are on his side. To hell with Rosenberg and his cabal. Sir Ratzik is Wenceslas' commander-in-chief. He stayed loyal to the king. And if he heard you talking like this, he would have you whipped like a dog. Your deal will soon have nothing left to rule. Jobs had to sell Luxembourg to help your king. South Bohemia is with Sigismund and... don't and forget about Gutenberg where Germans like you kissed Sigismund's feet to keep their heads. Yes, but... Goodman Deutsch, this is pointless. Let us talk of more pleasant things. My words, exactly. Deutsch has gone too far. Wenceslas is our rightful king. Deutsch is an idiot. But what can you do? I might have an idea. Deutsch deserves to be taught a lesson, doesn't he, Fritz? Too I'm after you. <laughs> Should give him a proper hiding. Are you mad? Do you want to end up in the pillory? Don't listen to Fritz. I've got a better idea. Deutsch was talking such shit, it made me think of that huge parlement. You know, the one right next to his freshly whitewashed house. <laughs> you think we should redecorate for him? Count me in. Well, I'd rather touch it to be honest. But doing some tears all day. What do you say? Henry? Wow. But I was going to get ale for a father and a, a few other things. We're finishing Sir Ratzik's sword. Come on. Doing a few handfuls of manure is not going to take all day. And it's our duty to defend the honor of our king. So, how? Are you with us? Oh, dialogue choices. I... I... got it now. Not that I don't want to teach the Deutsche a lesson, but I really don't have time. Well, that's disappointing. Still, we can manage without you. Let's go, lads. Oh, Dude, guys. Hell. How could you pass a good chance like this? It was tempting. May the Lord watch over you, Henry.
All right. Now I gotta see if I agree with it. What would happen? I know I'm kind of just like reloading and then playing the same sequence again after all that. But let's face it, that just sounds... Gosh, that sounds fun. It's what Kingdom Come Deliverance do well. They have actually interesting side missions. Why? Because they're realistic and they're super fun. Ah, it's satisfying to see you in your own crap and your own filth. Don't know why. Maybe it's effective because you were a prick. All right, horses. God be with you, Henry. And God be with you. Good day. See you later. How much charcoal did we need to get? I'll be back. Rags, fabric, what brocade, do you need? satin, Coming we'll up find it all here. Thanks. Thanks. Suit yourself. God save, Henry. All right. Now I'm curious of what will happen. Oh well, father can wait a while. <laughs> My words exactly. I knew you wouldn't miss out on all the fun. Let's go. So we're gonna literally touch literal turd. We're gonna touch literal turd. Let, let me get this straight. Touch literal turd. I, I, I had to repeat that three times. To throw at the Ducci's house. And how will that kind of prove that we're better than him when we're touching horse crap? I am amused though. So are we doing this or not? Wait. We have to check that the coast is clear. Why? The Deutsch is in the tavern. But maybe you noticed after all these years that he has a wife and a son. And that's a problem? Aye, it is. Henry, you go and lure her away somehow. Why me? <laughs> because you're the clever one. Yeah. And we know who's the stupid one. Clearly you, Fritz. You're the peer pressure one, and you're just a follower. I guess I'm the main protagonist. Hope you guys die. I kind of feel bad for doing this, but it's for the plot. <laughs> Typically, this is not for the plot. This is just a side mission and screwing around. What do you want, lad? I just went by the tavern, and your husband was in there talking nonsense. I thought someone should take him home before he gets himself in trouble. What sort of nonsense? Well, uh, well, he kept saying that Sigismund was right and King Wenceslas is a drunkard, that sort of thing. Some people took exception, so I thought... God almighty! The fool! Next thing he'll start on about the Popes! He might have mentioned the Popes too. Thank you for telling me. I just hope I can catch him before he gets into another fight. <laughs> I can't believe that freaking worked. Wow, she actually is running fast. Alright guys, we doing this? Oh, my reputation gets lost either way.
Why do I have to touch it first? Why don't you jack offs actually touch it first? What are you waiting for, soldier? Fire the trebuchet! Wow. For king and country! For king and country, my ass. This is all good, clean, fun. We just touch and turn. <laughs> Nearly as good as having that traitor in the pillory. Nearly. Now that would be sweet. <laughs> That's for Sigismund. Woohoo! Eat shit, doshes. You bastards! What the fuck do you think you're doing? That's a good point. <laughs> hey, Hans. Can't you see? We're decorating your house for you. It's like your old man was saying in a tavern about that traitor Sigismund. We're just doing what we have to do. Oh, sons! I'll make those smiles off your faces! Oh, I'd like to see you try. What are you doing here, Zbizek? Hanging out with this poxy doisha? Maybe you'd like to try out the latest German fashion. <laughs> Did you just throw a rock or turd at him? Fuck her! I'll make you pay for that! <laughs> Yeah. Oh, we're actually gonna fight. Oh, this is amazing. Ah, oh, thanks, bro. You gonna cry? You gonna cry? You gonna cry? Damn, Fritz. Damn, Fritz. You kiss your mother with that now? Oh, are you done? Are you done? Good. Stay there. I'm gonna go help my friends now. What are you doing? For God's sake! Stop right now! The catch pole is on his way! Run, you cowards! Look out! Let's run! Welcome, Henry. Ah, boys will be boys, right? Hey, how the heck did you get all the way up here? Uh, hello? H how did you get all the way over there? I guess I could tackle him. What the? Yeah, this will take up footage, but I do not mind. This was an interesting side quest that I was not disappointed uh, at all. Not yet, I don't. Oh, a little Give bit of glitch there, but hey, that's fine. Everything for the house. Why am I still following you guys again? Because I'm amazed. We we literally threw crap on a house. We crapped on a house. Wasn't there another guy with us? I... Oh, there he is. Well, we sorted that Deutsch out. <laughs> that was pretty close, eh? That old bastard didn't stand a chance. True, but I'm worried that fucker Hans will snitch on us. Well, let him. Then I'll snitch on him. And anyway, what can they do to us for throwing a bit of dung? Good point. It's not as if anyone really likes the Deutsch. Is 
a good thing your hanko warned us. Well-behaved girl like that. I'm surprised she didn't call the catch pole. She must have seen Matthias. What do you mean? Because he fancies her. And I think maybe she likes the look of him too. Hey. <laughs> Shut up, you idiot. Anyway, nice job at the Deutsches. Never a dull moment with you lot. <laughs> I was amused. I was amused. Darn it. That was a fun side mission. Disgusting, but fun. Okay, so. Was that like an auto save? Oh, I can't remember. How much coal? You know, all this kind of side mission and kind of uh, random stuff that I'm doing, I kind of forgot what I was supposed to do with <laughs> for his dad. <sighs> Video games. All right. Now to take it seriously. Oh. How are you, Henry? I'm doing good. Yeah, I can skip all that because I, I just had a amusing time with the... Uh... Nah. Not that I don't want to teach the Deutsche a lesson, but I really don't have time. Well, that's disappointing. Still, we can... Honestly, hell. Bye, guys. I already did it in one mission, but I'm a Paragon this time. All right. Uh, can I save? My pleasure. Uh. Oh, I can't save. Wait, for real? I think it was something about. Yeah, yeah, something about that. I need savior snaps. I don't know why I'm doing that. I don't care. God save my lovely. You're looking well today. <laughs> you too, handsome. What brings you here? I'm really doing the cliche line or AL. Your beauty, of course. <laughs> oh, noble sir. I'm as honored as any simple maid can be. And apart from my beauty, what else might your worship desire? Ba da 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 